Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. So in another video, I got a comment asking how could you do multiple patterns on your one light bar. So in this video, I'll be covering that. And I'm sorry if my mic is a little quiet. I'm not too sure why. Um, I'm going to try to fix that and in the next video, hopefully it'll be better. Anyways, let's just get started here. So it's just like before, you have your ELS and I'll link that video down below on how to script your emergency lighting system. So once you have, you know, all your parts, everything you need, we're going to create a script right now. And so since I do staged lighting, it's going to be different, but don't worry. I'll, I'll let you guys know if you're doing one stage cards, when to start copying. Okay, well, this is the start that everyone will need. Alright, so that's the start, and then you're going to do So since you one stage people are going to be looking like this, that's how yours is going to look, but since mine is uh, three stage, I'm going to have to keep going. Value dot value. Okay, so just real quick gonna have to do this. I haven't done this in months guys, so I'm surprised I'm still going here. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay. Uh, let's just do a wait time of zero. And this part for you ones for you people that are doing one stage ELS, don't worry about this part. You you don't need this yet. I'll let you know when. Else if main var dot on that value equals true and main var dot current stage dot value equals two then and now we're just going to take this, just make it faster and change it up a bit. Zero, one. Okay. So now we're going to be on our last stage here. So this is the stage where you guys, you could start copying me here. Okay. So I'm going to take my piece and we're going to make it do this. All right. And we could put this in a for loop. So basically what that does is it's going to do this certain pattern uh, a certain amount of times. Do. Okay. And then we're going to take this. All right. Just. Okay. Change up the pattern there. And then we're going to put an end underneath that. Okay, so that's how this part will look. So it'll do this pattern three times. Okay, and then now we're going to change it up. So let's take this piece, take it here, but let's change the pattern just like so. And that's, that's it. And um, yeah, so we could just apply it. All right, and there we go. So hopefully it's gonna work. I haven't done this in a while, guys. Okay, I just forgot to put our else at the end to make the lights up, but that's okay. So stage one, C, as we're going, press it again. Okay, well you guys basically don't really need to see this. That's stage two. And boy, oh boy, the amount of lag because of the amount of vehicles. <laughs> All right, C. Oops. So. Oh my gosh, it's going to be doing this and then switch to there. And basically that's it guys. That's how you do it. And if you want to make it, um, if you want to make each of these do it longer, you could just take that same part, copy and paste it underneath as well as this one. Copy and paste it. You guys do not have to press apply, I'm pretty sure it's only because it's a public studio with some other people. Okay. Alright. See how it's going for longer doing these two patterns? So yeah guys, that's basically how you do it. It does not even have to be this. It doesn't matter how many parts you have and you can add many, many, many more patterns. I just wanted to make this simple for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed and if you have any questions just ask me down below in the comments. And yeah, that's basically it guys. Have a good day.